Hey everybody, this is Zach at Virtuosity Musical Instruments in Boston, Massachusetts, here with the Ramponi and Kazani two-voice tenor saxophone. Ramponi and Kazani have been making instruments by hand in Quarnasota, Italy since 1815. That old world craftsmanship really reflects through their, their modern line. This has a hand-hammered sterling silver bell, as well as a solid sterling silver neck, bare brass body tube, Silver plated keywork and olive wood key inlays. Very, very comfortable under the fingers. It's a bit of a large bore horn, larger bow, larger neck. The grip is a little bit wider than most saxophone players would be used to. It is not too similar to a Selmer or a Yamaha or a modern ergonomic system. Very comforting, very easy to play, very responsive due to the materials of the instrument. I'm a big fan of it. It would appear it would have a bit of a dark sound. Uh, after playing a little bit more, it actually has a lot of resilience in the high end. It's, it's probably leaning more towards a bright instrument. I've found that using a large chamber mouthpiece makes a, a world of difference for this instrument. I'm using a Mouthpiece Cafe 8. Fairly large mouthpiece. Uh, this is an older model of theirs, the house blend. Francois Louis Ultimate Brass Ligature. Believe it or not, a softer read. I went down to about a two and a half from three, three and a half. And again, it made a huge difference. So I recommend trying out different setups when you play traditionally, if you're playing on a Selmer or a Yamaha or a Yanagisawa or a modern horn, you may want to change your setup just a bit to adapt to the larger bore. A little change could go a long way, so give it a shot.